So do you agree with your Surgeon General that the universal mandate to buy health insurance is good for our consumers? Well, I got some problems with the bill, obviously, but I support what the committee did because uh, passing a bill to defy the federal government's unconstitutional, it, uh, it would get us in a lawsuit just like the uh, Attorney General said. And so uh, I applaud what the committee did, support what the committee did, and had I been on the committee, that's the way I would have voted. Doesn't mean I'm totally enamored with every aspect of the bill. It's a different question. Well, do you, you think a resolution would be more appropriate? Excuse me? Do you think a resolution would be more appropriate? resolution would not get you sued. Uh, you know, a resolution, here's the problem. There are parts of that bill that are good and parts of that bill that are needed. There are parts of that bill I got problems with, mainly related to the fiscal aspect of what it does to our budget, which I've been saying all along. Uh, rather than an all or nothing thing, it's a great bill, let's support it, or it's a terrible bill, let's repeal it. Uh, if they're serious, they ought to sit down and try to figure out what the best of all parts of the bill would be and then go from there. Do you disagree with Joe Thompson's view of the mandate? What's his view? He said that it would, it, it, that the system does not work the way it works now. The system with so many does not. not paying into the that system. is, I agree with that. I'm not sure that the, if they'd have let me draw it my way to begin with, uh, I would have drawn it considerably different. I would have taken uh, an existing program like Medicare or Medicaid and uh, adopted it or altered it in a fashion that would have more clearly uh, accomplished the goal of, of trying to have more people paying their, their fair share so we didn't have a huge uh, uh, portion of the population that were, uh, were being given uncompensated care, which you and I and everybody else that pays for insurance pay for right now. Uh, but they didn't give me the chance to fix it. so. I, but I think the point is well taken, and the point is, it's not all bad and it's not all good. You know, there are parts of it, like what it does to state budgets that are already uh, in trouble. Uh, you know, I, I don't know where we're going to come up with that money. Uh, and I've been struggling with that all along, so the parts of it I don't like, the parts of it that uh, are obviously good. So, just to make sure I'm clear on the health, the health, insurance, clear on it. No, no. <laughs> health insurance mandate, is that the part you don't like or do? I didn't get, you bet, see you later. I didn't get specific on just the mandate part. I agreed with what the Surgeon General says, that uncompensated care is a hidden tax on all of us, that all of us are paying. If I was going to go about it, I would not have gone about it the way they went about it. That's, that's my answer.